Hello and welcome to our channel. In this video, I'll demonstrate how to run the Calibre DB Diff Utility to perform object comparison between two input OASIS files. Typical layout versus layout database comparisons is done using tools like Calibre NMDRC with XOR rules. Those flows are great for finding mask level differences between two layouts, but they don't report differences in objects between the databases. In this example, you can see that my layout versus layout comparison reported no errors. However, the dbdiff command line application will perform a cell-by-cell -cell comparison of objects found in each database. Here I am running just a simple dbdiff comparison and exporting differences to an ASCII RDB. dbdiff reports the two designs as different. Let's open the results in Caliber RVE and see what dbdiff found. Differences between the two databases are reported from the context of the reference design. The missing instance is one that was in the reference design, but missing in the current and is named via underscore one two. I'm highlighting this difference in my current design located on the left side of your screen. If I compare that to the reference design, I can see the missing instance. The layout versus layout comparison didn't catch that because the geometries match from a flat mask perspective. Let's see what other differences dbdiff reported. The rest of the differences are related to new or missing shapes. Here we can see that the shape in the current design is a polygon. When I investigate the mismatch shape in the reference design, we can see that it is a path object. For mass comparison, these are equivalent. But for object comparison, this is a difference that we want to catch. The dbdiff application includes many different comparison options to specify how to compare the two databases together. For this example, I'll add compare zero width paths and compare zero width polygons. Zero width objects are typically dropped in layout versus layout comparison. I'll also include the options to compare text objects between the two layouts and another to compare any properties attached to the objects. After rerunning dbdiff and reloading the differences in the RVE window, we see several more differences which were not reported in the layout versus layout run. First, we see new and missing text differences that is a result of adding the compare text option. The text shown in the reference design is different than the one in the current design. Next, we found a property difference that is reporting a difference we didn't see in the layout versus layout run. When I select the shape in the design, we can see a property attribute named placement and a value of reserved. By viewing the mismatch polygon in the current design, you can see there is no property at all. Lastly, we can see three missing shapes when I highlight to the current design. If I investigate those in the reference design, I find three path objects. If we query the object properties of these shapes in design rev, we can see that these are zero width path objects that were not reported when running layout versus layout. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. Or if you want to suggest a new video topic, please drop it in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.